Good morning, today I'm going to show how to normalize or mask form values using React hook form. Here is what we are building today. We have a card number field that will be normalized to have four blocks of four numbers. So if I try to enter 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, it will split it into four blocks of numbers. And when I will submit the form, I will get the normalized value. Also, I cannot enter more than 12 digits. And if I remove the characters, the normalization will be preserved. Let's see how can we do this using React Hook Form. I'm going to start with an empty component where I've already imported use form from React Hook Form. I got register and handle submit from it. I've defined a form with the on submit handler where I passed handle submit and my on submit handler function that gets the data and alerts it formatted as JSON. Let's define the card number input. First, I will create a wrapping div. Inside of it, I will define a label. This label will say card number and it will have an HTML4 attribute card number. This is needed for accessibility. Screen reader will announce the input with the corresponding label that it will find by the HTML4 attribute. Now let's define the input type tell. I use this input type so that on mobile phones the virtual keyboard will contain only the letters. Then I specify the placeholder. It will contain the example value for this field. In our case, four groups of four digits of zeros. I specify input mode, so it will be numeric, autocomplete type cc number. It will hint the browser what type of input it should try to autocomplete. Name card number and ID card number. Now, how do we normalize this field? To do this, we'll need to define an on change handler that will accept the event. And then we'll need to get the value from this input, normalize it using the sum normalization function and then assign it back to event target value. So we get the value const value equals event target. I use the structuring to get the value from the value field from the target. And then I call event target value equals normalize card number. And I pass value to this function. Now we need to define the normalize card number function. Let's define it outside of the component. Const normalize card number equals a function that accepts value. And then it returns value where we replace all the empty space characters with an empty string. We do this to prohibit the user to input spaces manually. Then we match the groups of four characters then we join those groups with the space and then we limit the string using the sub str method to be 19 characters 19 because we have uh, four groups of four characters and three spaces between them if there is no value we will return an empty string now scroll back down, pass the ref, it should be register. Now let's go to the browser and test our application. 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now let's try to remove the characters. And when we remove the last characters, we get an error that you cannot read the property join of null. It happens here and we can use the question mark to fix it. Here this question mark is an optional chaining operator. If our match will return null, instead of trying to get uh, to call the join method on nullish value, it will stop the execution of this chain and just return undefined instead of this whole expression. Let's go back to the browser, try to enter the data and remove it, and it works. Thank you for watching. Let me know in the comments what else would you like to know about React Forms. And also join my Discord server to pick the topics for the next videos. See you next time.